this is Oscar Sinclair with the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. Today is Thursday, January 28th, 2021. And all this week, I'm using discussion prompts from our Soul Matters small group material as a chance to do some reflecting on our theme of imagination. The prompt today is this. We all live with a voice that says, one day I will. So what possible life has been with you the longest? <sighs> the truth is for me, I'm living it, I'm living my version of it. <sighs> the possible life that's been with me the longest First time I remember watching a TV show and saying, I want to do that. I want to do what those people are doing. <sighs> Was the West Wing back what, 20, 25 years ago. <sighs> I remember watching the West Wing and saying, boy, these are people who get to think hard about important things that really matter in the world. And then they get to talk about them. <laughs> and through some miracle, they get paid to talk about them. I wonder how you do that. And that went through a couple different iterations in my life. For a while, I thought I wanted to be a lawyer. For a while, I thought I wanted to work in politics. But in the end, I kind of ended up right back where I started. Because through some miracle, <laughs> here I am in my mid thirties, walking through an unbelievably beautiful winter afternoon, talking into a microphone. And somehow, somehow this is my job. I don't think I could have actually imagined that when I was 15. I don't think I had the, I had the capacity to imagine that this would be a really cool thing to do theoretically. But I don't think I had the capacity to imagine what it would actually look like day to day. I'm so, so happy that I have had that chance. It's probably also worth saying that the, the possible world that I live with, that I'm also thankful for, is my life outside of work. So certainly plenty of time I thought that this being in my mid thirties, happily married with a young child, good relationships with all my family, that that was not going to happen. And somehow it has, somehow it did. So I don't take that for granted. Now I'm realizing that the theme is imagination, but really the theme of this question is gratitude for me. And that is also a spiritual discipline. So I'm going to stop talking for a while and just walk. and just experience gratitude for myself. And while I do that, wherever you are, take a moment and just reflect. What is it in your life today that you are grateful for? 
We'll leave the camera rolling for a bit while we all do that together. Thank you for your presence. I'll see you down the trail a little bit tomorrow. <laughs>